Hey guys, welcome to a new video. In this video here, we're going to talk about AI and computer vision. So this will be a short video where we're just going to talk about like what you should learn and what you should know in 2021 and going forward uh, within AI and computer vision. Also, if you're just starting out, like what are you act like, what are you going to learn first of all and stuff like that. But first of all, we're going to join the Discord server. I'll link to it down in the description here. And you can come join the channel, chat with us about computer vision, AI, deep learning. And also, if you have some problems with your project, you can go ask the questions in there. We have a really nice community where people help out each other. And I'm also answering questions um, in there. So definitely go check that Discord server out. And you can also now become a member of the channel if you want to support the channel with a small amount of fee. And everything will go to create more and better quality content here on the channel. So thank you guys. So now we're just going to talk about like what should you actually like learn within AI and computer vision. And throughout this channel here, I've mainly been focusing on actually like AI and computer vision, where first of all, we have been starting out with the basic stuff about computer vision uh, and doing different kind of like basic operations on images with, for example, like image filtering, how we can reduce noise in images, how we can do detections of different kind of edges corners and, and stuff like that and then we took it to another level where we try to use all these things together with for example like in camera calibration uh stereo vision how we can create projects around that we also created some computer vision uh projects on top of that so what you should learn about computer vision is definitely like the, like definitely the basics about computer vision methods the theory behind different kind of computer vision uh, techniques so you know like what different kind of techniques do you actually like need to apply and the best modules are actually like use these techniques and use computer vision in code, both if you're using C++ and Python, it's definitely like to learn C++ or OpenCV um, on a really high level, or at least like learn it and then you learn how to use the actual like documentation because the OpenCV documentation is really, really uh, good to know and also how we can read it. Because if you know how to read it and know how to code, you can actually like just go into the documentation copy paste the, uh, like the, the, the methods from there. You can see all the input parameters it takes. You can see exactly what the function or method does. And you can also see the output that you will get. And then you can just transfer that into your own application um, or project. But for computer, pre computer vision, you should definitely know OpenCV. It doesn't really matter if you're using C++ or Python. Uh, it is it's actually just what you what you prefer yourself. I've also made some videos where we're doing some comparisons and talking about like the difference between OpenCV and Python. But here on YouTube and just in general, where like people start to use more Python or like a lot more Python compared to C++ when we're working with computer vision and when we go over to AI, like people, you should definitely just learn Python and be really good um, in Python and then use that for AI or like specifically deep learning as we have done throughout this um, uh, channel here. On my channel, I also have a deep learning tutorial. So when I create a new tutorial, I, I, I start with going out over like the theory. So inside the deep learning tutorial and a computer vision tutorial, I start on a really uh, basic level. So all the beginners and, and people not familiar, uh, familiar with AI and computer vision can follow along. And then we just go step by step and take it to another level to try to like gain you more knowledge so you can learn more and you can apply more uh, deep learning techniques and computer vision techniques um, in your own projects and stuff like that. So this is kind of like a journey where we go from like the beginning level to a more advanced level. And then when we're at the advanced level, we know how to use the techniques from the basic level and how we can apply that in projects and create some really nice and cool projects and applications. And then inside of computer vision, again, as I said, we're using more uh, Python and I'm also going to create a Python tutorial. So how we can actually use uh, Python to uh, like, uh, like, uh, like uh, make our Python programs faster by using Cython so we can actually like create more and faster applications like we would do in C++ because that, that is actually like the only advantage with C++ is that if we're writing our own logic and our own code, we will speed up our, our applications a lot more by using C++ compared to Python. But with Cython, we can actually speed up our applications to be as fast as our applications in C++ and it's just way easier to use Python and Python is just growing so fast. We can use all different kind of modules inside of Python. So for computer vision, you should learn OpenCV on a really high level or like at least on a basic level and then know how to use the documentation. You should know the basic um, operations inside of computer vision and also the theory. So you know what methods do we actually like need to apply. And then inside AI and deep learning, you should definitely like choose a framework that you're comfortable with, or at least you want to learn. And then you can act easily tra translate that or like transfer that information to the other frameworks as well. 
But in this in this channel here, I've mainly been focusing on TensorFlow. I'll also cover cover PyTorch later on. But if you're new to AI and deep learning, um, I I would like to like um recommend starting off with TensorFlow. And then when you actually like have TensorFlow OpenCV, you can start to actually like combine computer vision and AI, and we can get these modern computer vision techniques where we use deep learning to actually like analyze our images. We can do classification. We can do detection of different kind of objects inside of our uh, inside of our images by using deep learning and combining that with computer vision. So we need to know all of these different kind of things, and then we can actually like combine all of them together. We can even combine OpenCV, TensorFlow. We can also in, uh, combine uh, NVIDIA with CUDA. So if we want to use the GPU to actually like train our neural networks or like speed up our processes and techniques within computer vision, we can also use NVIDIA with CUDA. But if you're starting out from scratch with um, with like learning computer vision and AI, I'll definitely uh, go with uh, the CPU first. And then when you have actually like have the basic stuff, uh, right and you have learned that then you can build more on top of that so it's just like a, a process where we're taking step by steps uh, step by step and then we just build on top of that all the time so when we have all this combined we can then apply and build on top of that CUDA with NVIDIA so we can speed up our processes and our and we can actually like create real-time applications with computer vision TensorFlow and also with uh, with by you just using Python code so I definitely just go with Python code uh, from now on because when I'm going to introduce you to, to Cython, we can speed up our processes if you want to create some real-time applications and so on. Um, so it's really nice, it's really cool, and I'm just really excited for it. So now we have like this building block or like this foundation on the channel here for the different kind of like computer vision techniques that we can use and also deep learning techniques. We go over the basic stuff and then we just we just keep building on top of that all the time, create some really nice and cool applications, compile them all as I've already said, and then I just hope you guys can learn a lot from it and you can combine it yourself and learn from it, use it in your own applications, your own projects, and you can just see like how cool and nice this is. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video here. I just want to like talk about what you should actually like learn if you're getting started to AI and computer vision, and also if you've been using computer vision and AI and you already have uh, the knowledge about the fundamentals both in computer vision and AI then we can actually like how we can combine all these things together we can even take it to a further level where we use like artificial intelligence for like uh, segmentating out different kind of things we can do cloud uh, cloud point processing um, we can do detection of different kind of things with AI and computer vision and we can build on top of that with NVIDIA CUDA and so on so you will never stop. You you should never stop learning uh, things, and you should never stop building things on top of what you already know. So thank you guys for watching this video here, and remember to hit the subscribe button and bell notification under the video here, and also like this video here if you like the content and you want more of in the future. I really appreciate it, and it just really helps me and the YouTube channel out in a massive way. So I'll link to one of the tutorials up here that I have mentioned with the computer vision tutorial and the deep learning tutorial, or else I'll just see you in the next video, guys. Bye for now.